Happy Monday, guys, and welcome back on into a new episode of Let's Play Spider-Man. We are nearing the end. Pete, hey, I've been through the city, state, and federal databases. If this Devil's Breath Lab does exist, it's off the books. The only other place I can think to look is in Norman's personal files. I've already been through his office computer. Are you thinking his penthouse? That building's full of Sables, man. If they spot me, other residents could get hurt in a firefight. I know, but... I might be able to get in undetected. I can sneak in, find the lab's location, and get out. If anything goes wrong, I'll call you for backup. Okay. It's risky, but we need that location. Wait for me to get nearby, then make your move. I'll be ready. I was waiting for the phone call to end, but yes, guys, we are nearing the end here of the main story. So what I am thinking I'm going to do is we're going to finish the main story. We'll start a second game. And we'll get through that game. And then we'll jump into the DLC and then the Miles Morales game. Now reports are coming in that Martin Lee, along with exhibiting freakish abilities like those of you-know-who, has lately seemed to display almost a split personality. <laughs> this is hogwash and a clear attempt to evade justice for his crimes. Only a fool would believe that he's Mr. Positive one moment, helping the poor with a smile, then suddenly he's Mr. Negative, blowing up, wait a minute, Mr. Negative. Okay, MJ, I'm a couple blocks away. Let me know if you get into trouble. Thanks, Pete. Wish me luck. Last okay. stealth mission of the game here, guys. Norman's penthouse is on the top floor, but the elevator's on lockdown. Need to get into the security room to unlock it. Mayor Osborne really lives here? There's the security room. But that guard will see me if I go in. Residents are pretty upset. Maybe I can rile them up to create a distraction. I like riling people up. But yeah, guys, how, how's our Monday? Did, did you have a good weekend? Upstairs. I heard they'll let you up if you claim special circumstances. The health emergency might do it. Really? Come on, let's go talk to security. Hey, let us back upstairs. Oh, every second we stay down here, we risk catching that plague. Definitely stay away from the receptionist. Been coughing up a storm. What? They have to let us back upstairs. Why isn't Osborne down here? This sort of thing never happens to him. The mayor and his friends are exempt. Security let one of his biggest donors back upstairs right away. I knew it. It's all one big boys club. Come on. Nice, MJ. That should do it. Jerry, get out here. We got a situation. Get out here right now. Security We've room's open. Just need to get to the door without being seen. Everyone, please stay calm. Sable International has nearly finished their sweep. That's what you said an hour ago. I know this is frustrating, but please remember, Sable is doing this for your safety. Hello. I know a few Sable agents who would love to meet you. I like this thing. Gotta turn him around. Good boy. I'm sure Sable offers workman's comp. Elevator <laughs> controls in the security room. Next to the Sable agent. Mary Jane Watson? Super spy. Time to Hi. unlock that elevator. <clears throat> that did it. Norman's clearing out, and the elevator's unlocked. Time to head upstairs. Oh, really? We gotta go back the way we came? Penthouse elevator. This is it. 
Norman and Sable, right on cue. Find the alarm technician. Fire him. Stupid useless button. Hmm. Nice one, MJ. Norman's guards have all cleared out. If he's hiding something up here, I'm gonna find it. Warning. Fire doors engaged. What is this thing? Hmm. Schematics for a prototype combat mask. Looks like it can reveal structural weaknesses. Whoa, this mask is incredible. Is it showing a door hidden in that wall? I wonder where it leads. I want to know how come we don't have a mask like that. Blueprint for the apartment. Tons of empty space right behind the wall with a family portrait. Who leaves space unused in a Manhattan apartment? MJ, Sable presence downstairs just ballooned. I think Norman's being moved. Worried they might spot me. I might have had something to do with that. Keep your distance. I should be okay for now. The fabulous Osborne. Norman bids his son farewell. Hmm. This must be from when Harry left for Europe last year. Secret keypad behind the family portrait. Norman must like spy movies. I need to find the code for that keypad. Hmm. Scientific journals debating the Spider-Man problem. <laughs> so weird there's a whole cottage industry focused on explaining Pete's powers. Weirder still that Norman is such an active part of it. That's where we came from. Work order for a keypad lock. Looks like he used Harry's last day as the code. That must be the day Harry left for Europe. Self-diagnostic complete. No phone found. Fire doors disengaged. <sighs> Norman could be back any minute. Need to find that keypad code. Harry said his mom used to cook all the time. I'd be surprised if Norman has ever even touched the stove. On my way to Dr. Michaels for one last shot before the, um, the big trip. Um, uh, hey, if you're gonna meet me there, could you grab my journal from my room? I just wanted to record some thoughts on the big Bon Voyage day. <laughs> uh, anyway. Listen, I know I don't say this enough, but... Thank you, Dad. You know, for doing this. I love you. Wow. Haven't heard Harry's voice in so long. He sounds so... tired. Let's hope that journal is still here. Gotta check his room. Harry's mom, Emily. We used to make fun of him for calling her the prettiest mom at Midtown, but he might have been right. Score! This must be the key for Harry's room. Norman and Otto. Wow. They look like they used to be so close. What could have ruined a friendship like this? What ruins every friendship like that? Money. Can't be for Harry, can it? Law books. 
Harry wants to be an environmental attorney, like his mom. Harry's journal. His last entry is marked July 18. That must be the code to that room. Peter Parker and Mary Jane Watson. Guys, I'm sorry, really sorry for reading this, man. This is tough. Even an imagined hypothetical letter to you, it's hard to be honest. Here goes. I'm sick. Like, really sick. Doctors think it's the same thing Mom had. Neurodegeneration, rapid onset. I've known for a while, but thought I could manage it. I didn't tell you because, well, because I didn't tell you. I was worried how you'd react, and I couldn't stand to see you go through what I did with my mom. Watching her suffer, knowing I couldn't help watching her die was worse than dying. <clears throat> Things got bad, really bad recently. All the times I was wiped out from partying or just super busy, not partying, not busy, sick. The Euro trip, well, it's a cover. I'm going in for treatment, experimental, long-term. Dad's been working on it forever, promises it'll work. He hates the nickname the techs have for it, Devil's Breath. Says it makes something good seem scary, but maybe devil's breath is what I need. A little bit of bad to do a lot of good. Hmm. I am saying we should not rush off without a plan. We? You are staying here. The antiserum is ready, and I'm going to supervise production. You will be completely vulnerable without me. I seem to be completely vulnerable with you. I'm going alone. End of discussion. Keep Team 2 on standby. I'm getting some air. And now it just got fun. Hey, Norman's cure is ready. He's headed to the lab it's at now. Can you follow? Not without alerting him. Somebody spiked Sable's coffee today. Her men are set on double secret probation alert. Okay, then stay ready. I've almost got the location. July 18. Bingo. Just gotta find the location of the Devil's Breath Lab. Something in this room must be useful. Norman Osborne, GR27 Research Log. The whole project has gone to hell. GR27 is a cure. Not a disease, but try telling that to the evening news. Somehow, they've picked up the technician's morbid nickname, Devil's Breath, and are using it to stoke hysteria. They have no idea what it's really capable of. A cure for cancer, genetic disorders, birth defects. With just a little more research, I know we could perfect it. Instead, I'll spend the next 18 months on PR mama. Norman's got a real mad scientist thing going on. What are these things? 
prototype hand grenades? Wow. Norman wins the fancy map contest. Huh. Commercial. Wow. Oscorp's going all in on defense. Looks like Norman's tracking the doctor's no move. Dr. Michaels leads the Devil's Breath team. Sable Troop. I bet I can find the Devil's Breath lab with this. It must be an Oscorp property with a ton of Sable protection, frequented by Dr. Michaels. Nope. That's just a Sable patrol. None of these patrols cross Dr. Michaels' path. No. A records facility could be Oscorp's going all no. A records facility Oscorp's going all in on defense research. Devil's Breath Lab must have a big si nice. Got some overlap with Dr. Michael's path. Should check the patrol routes against a good old Alpha. Devil's Breath Lab must have a no. A records facility could be perfect cover GR27. That's the code name for Devil's Breath. This is it. Tenth and Cathedral. Isn't that... I knew it. Tenth and Cathedral, Oscorp's records department. <laughs> Perfect place to hide a secret biotech facility. GR27 Martin Lee incident. What is this? And now we get some backstory on Martin and Lee. we are rolling. I... We'll be right next door. Just relax and let the medicine do its work. Created Lee. I, I have to get this. What? No! Who's there? Oh no. Oh. Nice going, MJ. Breach. High alert. Come on, you could have become a spider person. Pete, I've got the lab location. And a lot more. How far away are you? Two avenues over. Say the word and I'm there. Great. Keep the motor running. Clear that balcony. Ready? 
Wait, wait, hold on! It's too late. You're up! You are crazy. You're amazing. <laughs> it's all so much to take in. Harry sick, Norman and Lee, and Dr. Octavius? I know. This is all my fault. No, not this song again. You are not alone anymore, Pete. Let Miles and me look after Feast. You... you find Norman. You find the cure. Thanks. Partner. To get that anti serum and start putting things right. There must be some way to reach Lee and Otto. Convince them to give up this crusade for revenge. They've both done so much good for the world, they can't throw their legacies away just to spite Norman. Do this one. I have to get that anti serum and start and putting things right. We will finish this there must tomorrow. be some way to reach Leonardo. Convince them to give up this crusade for revenge. They've both done so much good for the world. They can't throw their legacies away just to spite Norman. these demons before I can follow Lee into the lab. Time to KO those snipers. To get through these demons quick before Lee gets a hold of the anti serum.
My men will handle this. Sable? Lee wiped out the agents stationed here. They're not handling anything. You have been warned, superhero. <laughs> Sable made good on her threat, but these guys aren't looking to team up. I'm tired of you harassing our agents, Spider-Man. This ends tonight. You guys think I took out your men? You gotta be kidding me! Table are down. Time to follow Lee inside. Why are you so heavy? You harass my men, destroy my equipment, and cost my client millions. Give me one good reason I should not kill you right now. Listen. I don't like you, you don't like me. But Lee has your client inside this building right now, and he's gonna kill him if we don't do something. We could fight each other, or we could fight Lee, but not both. Does this mean we're good? You will help me secure Norman. After that, I make no promises. Works for me. Lee's out of control. You secure Osborne. I will talk to them. Oh. I have friends. Okay, Lee. No more running. This ends tonight. This is insanity. I have to find a way to reach the Martin Lee I know. The man who built Beast. No way to go but down. Turn back, Spider-Man. This is between me and us. I know about the accident. I know what happened to your parents. The accident? You sound as clinical as Osborne. My parents died because of me! Because of what Osborne did to me! You're more than your past! Don't let it control you! I tried so hard to make my parents proud! To honor their legacy! But to truly honor them, Osborne must see justice! I won't let you do this, Martin! It's just or Osborne, it's fine. This is the only sample. No, no, Martin. 
I told you, I'm sorry. It was an accident. I was trying to help you. You don't help people. You use them. This won't bring your parents back. Why do you insist on trying to save this piece of scum? I'm trying to save you, Martin. Don't let revenge win. Fight it! Martin, you can walk away! No! Osborne must suffer! Go back to this again, okay. <sighs> My 
Jesus. This is the wrong way, Mark. Ah, dog. Useless. Beat, you just got your ass kicked, homie. on your face you can't imagine how satisfying it is ready for your final act worry about him right now he needs a hospital no no hospital feast I need to speak to your head doctor. There's no doctors here. Well, who's running this place? Me, mostly. Oh, okay. Well, it's been a while, but I'll do my best. I'll need masks, uh, gloves, right. whatever you have to sterile. You can thank me by not dying. Oh my god.
He'll live. But he needs rest. Yeah, if he don't rest. Take it easy. Where's me? They say she could go at any moment. Where are you going? I need to find Otto. He has the anti serum. <laughs> Maybe you can't. Maybe Spider-Man needs help from his friend Peter. What? Peter helped build those arms, remember? If anyone can find a weakness, it's him. Go get him, Tiger. And the spider right. that will make miles. No. No, that's not it. Maybe it's this one. No. Uh, Guys, that's MJ's where we'll leave right. it for tomorrow. I built it. Tomorrow, tomorrow we beat interface. the game, and we and we uh, put uh, Otto down for good. It means I can destroy it. So I will catch you guys tomorrow, and we will see the conclusion.